Welcome back to the Noodle Bowl. Have you ever wondered if the dollar store brand is as good as a national brand? Well today, we're gonna put that to the test. We have bought several items and their national brand counterparts and we're gonna give them a taste test and see which one's better. Coming up. At the Noodle Bowl, we are big fans of the dollar store. We try to live as affordably as we possibly can with three kids. What we're gonna do here is we're gonna look at each item, what you get from the dollar store for a dollar, and then what you get at the national chain at their price, and we're gonna taste test them, see which if they, they taste close enough, and also talk about which one we feel is a better value. So let's get started. Yee! We're gonna do Cheetos. We have the, uh, the crunchy real Cheetos. Real deal. And we have Brim's crunchy cheese curls. The, f the fake deal and the real deal. The fake deal and the real deal. Let's see what they look like. So Cheese these ones you can see through the bag. I'll open it. Or the last one you ripped it all over. All right, so we got Cheetos. So we got cheese curls. Which I'm pretty sure we're all familiar with, with Cheetos. <laughs> okay. Mac and cheese. Yeah, so the uh, Cheetos is a nice bright color. The cheese curls are kind of um, anemic looking. Color. They're just oh. kind of pale. Now they do say they're made with real cheese, just like the Cheetos. So that's good. All right. Three, two, one. Hey, do you need that many to try Cheetos? Okay, first off, the main difference between the two, um, the crunch. This has a nice satisfying kind of crisp. This is kind of like a styrofoam uh, consistency. Mm. Um, Flavor-wise, this, it just tastes off. It doesn't taste like cheese, it kind of tastes like like cheese balls. This is kind of like cheese balls, but not in a good way. Like a cheese puff Like crunch. a cheap cheese puff type thing. Um, I spent some time in Jamaica, and they have cheese balls that kind of taste like this. Yeah, I don't like it. I think cheese is the way to go. Uh, Cost-wise, these ones cost $2.98. These ones are a buck. So they're about the same size. I don't know, maybe you could develop a taste for them. I'm gonna stick to Cheetos. Yeah, me too. Yeah, just continuously eat that until you get used to it. Until you tell you, it's one of those things that maybe you'll get used to it. Maybe you'll get to the bottom and, oh, I guess I they're like okay. Those. But, no. These are good. Ooh, rings. All right. Ring, 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 ring. Ring, 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 ring. Okay, so Battle of the Peachos. We have the Trolley Peachos, the original, and then we have Peach Rings by Coastal Bay. A dollar versus a dollar fifty. If you were a grown up, you could uh, you could ha have one of these and ask someone to marry you uh, with, with it. Marry me with my peach ring. Noodle, you... Noodle Mommy might have said yes, she loves these. Uh, size wise, there's way more in this bag than there is in this bag. This one's kind of, I mean, that much versus that much. About double the size. So you are getting more for less. Let's see if the flavor's okay. They smell the same. I'm married. There's but there's a little bit difference, in, a little bit of difference in color, but they're pretty close. If you had those side by side in the same bag, I don't think you'd be able to tell the difference. Three, two, one. The Peachos, honestly, these are fine. Um, the the cheaper brand, uh, the peach flavor is a little bit stronger with the uh, the name brand, but not to the point of wanting to pay 50% more for half as much. I would definitely say this is probably the way to go. Mm -hmm. so, not bad. These are Swedish fish. Everybody loves Swedish fish. And then the knockoff assorted juju fish. Mm, bad juju this time. <laughs> Got some bad juju. For a smaller bag, where again, you're getting about maybe 50% more with this one. This is a $1.75. Uh, this ones are a dollar. Um, so let's see if it's worth it. Mm. Tastes like Swedish fish. Good, subtle, fruity flavor. I like the flavor, but the texture is weird. I'm just spit it out. It's weak. It's way too soft. Really? Mm-hmm. It's really soft. Try one. It's so weird, I need to spit it out. Grab your sweetest fish. Three, two, one. 
Okay, so I think these two, these, both of those have been Yeah, these ones are a little bit, the Swedish, the actual Swedish fish have a little bit of a tougher gimme. These ones are a little bit softer, a little squishier. Flavor-wise, flavor they're really close. I again would say that the off-brand is as good, if not better, than the original. No, the original is better. We have a split decision. All right, so gummy worms. You got your trolley brand. Squiggles. And squiggles. You got your trolley brand, and you got your Coastal Bay again, gummy worms. Uh, tropical flavors. Ooh. Tropical. Um, dollar fifty, a dollar. Uh, Size-wise, they're about the same, so you're getting about the same amount. 50% more. Let's see if it's worth it. That's fat-free. 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 It's healthy. It's not healthy. No. It's all sugar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then why does it say that? Because there is fat no fat free. and sugar, but that doesn't necessarily mean yeah. it's healthy. Okay. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Ready? Trey, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Three. Mm, I'm just kidding. Worm. I was the the gummy worm. worm. Do the gummy worm. Do the gummy worm. Okay. Wiggle wiggle wiggle. <laughs> wiggle 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 ready three two one should i look it's a candy and a toy mm -hmm. this is tough side by side comparison they look like gummy worms they look the same it's hard to tell these wiggle, ones wiggle, are a little bit tougher the trolley are a little bit firmer where the uh, um, coastal are a little bit more of a soft one um, a little bit more stretchy. More wormy? More worm-like. <laughs> yeah, this one is. Look, it's it's super warm. Ready? Da, 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 da. Three, two, one, go. Again, same thing. The the flavor in the name brand is stronger and more pronounced, but for the price difference, um, the, the off-brand for the gummy worms, I don't think you can screw up gummy worms. For our final one, we've got the soda side by side. So we've got Sprite, and we've got Stars and Stripes Loopy Lemon. Lemonade, lemon lime flavored soda with other natural flavors. All right, so cost-wise, these small little ones um, are 50 cents a piece, where this bigger can is gonna be 25 cents a piece. That means that um, one's gonna taste worse. So, I mean, so you, again, you find about the same differences where it's just, just generally cheaper. To, to go with something like this. Um, so let's see if there's a difference. That one says loopy, it's gonna make us loopy. Loopy, loopy, loopy. loopy. Three, Good. two, one, go. Oh, that's strong. So what do we think, good? Not that. It's lemon lime, I mean it tastes, it kind of tastes Sprite-ish. So, I, it wasn't bad. Let's try the actual name brand Hold Sprite. Up, Down it, chug, 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 chug. Down the hatch. That is, that is that is really bubbly. Alright. You love Sprite. I know you love Sprite. I love Sprite. I'm gonna have a mixture with the um, loopy lime. Looks lime. the same. Three, two, one. I don't want to get burned. Ugh. Okay. That tastes good. It just bubbles in my throat. There's definitely a reoccurring theme here. Uh, the flavor Ooh. of the Sprite is stronger, more pronounced where it's almost a little watered down with the uh, Stars and Stripes. But I mean, it wasn't bad. I mean, store brand sodas, I mean, for a long time, were pretty close. Uh, it, it's soda. It, I mean, if you're looking for a sugary carbonated beverage, that's a good good money-saving mm -hmm. option. Oh, I want All the right? Stars and Stripes. I claim that for my drink. Okay. No. You like the Stars and Stripes better? Yeah. Which one do you like better? Um, Stars and Stripes. Wow. Rock, paper, scissors. They prefer it. All together, uh, it was actually surprising. I went into this expecting all of the, the uh, dollar store brands to be not as good as the more expensive uh, um, counterparts. Uh, turns out I was incorrect. Um, there are some alternatives. The candies were pretty close on, um, but there were a few things that were off. Those Cheetos were nowhere close. Leave us a comment down below uh, on something you found from the dollar store that you like better than the national brand. It'll uh, be interesting to see if there's something else that we should try out and different ways that we can save a little money ourselves. Uh, we, we appreciate you guys watching. We appreciate you guys taking the time to watch our video. Uh, please consider some subscribing if you enjoyed that and as always please smash that like button click right here to subscribe and also click that little bell so that you don't miss any of our noodle family action good bye bye, bye. bye.